My idea was to get a, a solar collector going and get some batteries and be 100%, partly to make myself independent from the co-op. But batteries cost so much money and the co-op uh, will let you uh, pump your excess electricity back into the grid and they'll they'll pay you something for it. Uh, I found out that uh, since I bought this that uh, you produce electricity year-round and uh, there may be uh, four or five days in the year when you don't produce as much but you produce electricity every day and in the winter time I produce more electricity than what I use in my house. In the summertime, my house uses more electricity than I can produce. So the co-op becomes my battery. You take all the incentives that they had to offer, and a $18,000 unit only ended up costing $8,000. What it's doing is uh, uh, saving me half of my electric bill. And I think that I would be getting, someplace in my sixth year, I'd be getting all my money back from my investment. And so from then on, I'll be making money. Okay, this is our, this is our solar array, and there's six panels on each side. And uh, each one produces 750 watts. Anyway, this uh, follows the sun. As soon as the sun comes up in the east, it immediately just starts heating up and that Freon pushes the liquid up to the other end it gets heavy and down she comes and then when when both sides are getting heated equally as the Sun moves it follows the Sun one side starts getting shaded and the other one starts boiling and just gradually moves so this doesn't require any electricity to uh, make it operate and it works as soon as the Sun hits it, it starts working and uh, works all day long. It's balanced and it's got these great big old shock absorbers on it that hold it still in the wind. You can see the wind blowing and how it just holds it. And uh, I don't know how big of a wind it'll withstand, but uh, nothing seems to phase it. That's built really strong. 100% professional. I mean everything, nothing shoddy about it. Everything is just really put together right. Now here's where uh, they bring the power in underground. It comes in here. This changes the direct current from that solar collector into alternating current. Then it goes in here and it measures what the collector produces. Then it goes in here and this is what the county has. When the county was selling me electricity, the meter would turn just, just like this meter here is turning right now as we're making the, the power, or collecting the power. In the winter time, that meter would run backwards. So subtracting from my bill, you know, as it would run backwards, I kind of like that feature. I think I'm saving about half of my uh, electric. Well, yeah, it makes it so I can run the cooler. <laughs> I've got uh, two deep freezes and two refrigerators, and they run all the time. And in the summertime, that air conditioning, that, that the thing that uses electricity most. And uh, of course the computer and the TV. So I'm gonna help, what? Keep the earth from getting too hot by saving on electricity. But mainly I think I'm gonna help from using too much coal down there at the power plant. Well, I wanna be independent. So I'm planning on getting another one of these units uh, and eventually get my batteries and then I will. I will be independent. Well, why would I want to go with Sun Pump as to another company? Because one, Sun Pumps is local, and if I want them to come out here and work on something, they will do that. One day my meter quit turning. That same day they came out and made my meter turn. I sat in that office, and they proposed several different plans to me. And he's got a computer program in there where he can pull up just about anything I want and tell me how much it'll cost. The price for that electricity is just going to go up, just like everything else. Actually, uh, the faster the price goes up, the faster I get my money back. So that's the way I look at it. I think it's a real good investment. I think that uh, there's so much sunshine here, you know, and we've got all the power anybody could ever ask for. 
if we would just use it.